All right, second video. If you haven't seen the first one, go to my channel and check it out because it won't make sense to you. Anyways, I've got the engine all ripped apart. I took off the valve covers. I took off the flywheel. There's my dog. Took off the oil pan, drained the fluids, all that. And um, this was on a wasted spark setup, so I, I'm in the midst of converting it back to distributor. Took off the exhaust manifolds, um, AC mounts, all that stuff. So basically I'm taking everything off to clean it up. So I'm gonna be cleaning up the engine because it looks like crap. And I'm also looking for a spot to get oil for my turbo and I found it right here. So I need to take this Allen out and then my adapter for my feed for my turbo can go in there. Yeah, so pretty much all I'm doing to the engine is resealing the valve covers and uh, doing oil bung for the oil pan and the turbo feed line. Repainting it and getting everything figured out for the turbo setup. Yeah, I'm gonna take this guy out and make sure there's no old oil in there. Yeah, so before I paint the engine and stuff, I wanna make sure oil's not gonna come out in random holes later on when I take things apart, because that always happens. It always drips out hardcore, even if the oil pan's completely off. There's one over here too. Now I'm going to clean the engine with the engine cleaner. So I did a quick clean on her, not looking too bad. I had uh, valve covers laying around that I could just throw on for the meantime. And now I'm gonna paint it. Okay, she's all painted up. I don't have the valve covers on obviously, that's in the future. I'm gonna, these are, these are just covers for me not getting water in, so I'm going to put the new valve covers on with new gaskets. So that's gonna be new sealed. All the gaskets that aren't underneath the head gasket and everything, I'm gonna be replacing, just so I don't have any leaks and that stuff's really annoying to me. This is the front of the engine, which would face the front bumper and turbo is gonna be in front here. So this is where I am getting my oil feed. So I'm gonna put that guy in there. So it adapts from the oil pump to a small oil feed line that will go to the top of the turbo. Okay, it's time to assemble the engine. I've got lots to go on. I got a distributor. I have brackets for my alternator. I have my Fidenza lightweight flywheel, Clutch Master's clutch fi or six puck, my engine mounts, my new alternator, and valve covers, intake, all that good stuff. Everything that you see here came with the red car, so I haven't paid for anything. This is all just what came with, other than the alternator. I've had this alternator on my other car, so I'm just gonna reuse it. Okay, as you can see, I've got everything ready for the mock-up for the exhaust. That's what I'm going to be doing in the next video. I'm going to be getting those ready and starting on the welding. Comment, like, subscribe, and let me know what other things I could be doing in the shop.